After leaving campus five years ago, Megan Gustafson's basketball journey has taken her from the WNBA to Hungary, Greece, England, and all across the European continent. Now Megan will have the opportunity to play in this summer's Olympic Games, but not for her home nation. Her jersey is one of only two Hawkeyes that currently hangs in the rafters at Carver, but Megan Gustafson never got the Final Four treatment that I was enjoyed the last two years. No red carpet, but a gold medal now adorns Megan's international trophy case after winning a Euro Cup championship with the London Lions. London Lions are the 2024 FIBA Euro Cup women's champions. That crowd you see in London would have been nearly unthinkable just one year ago, similar to Caitlin Clark and the Hawkeyes breaking attendance and viewership records stateside. Megan and the Lions are doing the same in Europe. Trailblazers, groundbreakers, and history makers. You know, in the beginning of the season when I was here, we hardly had any fans, but now we're, we're getting 1,500, 2,000 plus, um, which has been really exciting. We won the British Trophy um, final, and there was probably eight, eight, 9,000 people there. When we keep winning, we keep bringing people in and, and drawing them in. Um, that drink brings a lot of fans to the away games as well as the home games. Now, after winning a European championship, Megan has become a European citizen. Earlier this year, she went through the steps to earn a Spanish passport in order to play for Spain's national team during the summer's Olympics. If you're confused, Join every other Hawkeye fan and coach. She said, I got to fly to LA. I'm applying for my Spanish citizenship. And I was like, whoa, I, I'm, are you Spanish? Turns out, no, there is no Spanish DNA in Megan's 23andMe results. You stop her on the short roll. But this is not an uncommon career turn for professional women's players who can be invited to become a citizen of another country in order to get more opportunities for competition during the WNBA offseason. There are a lot of other WNBA players that do the same thing. Um, it kind of just skirts around the rules, I guess. Not only is it great to obviously go into the Olympics and have that opportunity, but it also helps my career professionally overseas because I don't count as an American anymore. Um, and there are limitations on however many Americans you have per team. I want to be in the Olympics. I want to be able to to be a part of a family, a team, and they've been so, so welcoming to me. I'm actually going to be taking Spanish lessons. They're hiring a Spanish teacher. Habla Espanol? Uh, un poco, un poco. <laughs> uh, como se dice pancake? Oh, boy. Um, tortita. That's right. Not only is Megan's international career expanding, but ever by her side is the fluffy four-legged short stack who's become Megan's constant companion in her international adventures. Fun fact, Pancake has a Polish passport. Um, I originally got her in Poland when I was playing in Hungary. Um, she's always in my contracts for overseas teams. I will not go to a team if I can't bring my dog. Like, that's just a big no-no for me. You know, just having her with me wherever I go is so important. She is my child. She's like, she is literally my child. And whenever I have a bad day with basketball, if I'm not feeling like I did well, my worries instantly go away. Um, so she's definitely therapeutic in that aspect. Gustafson steps back. She can shoot the three. Megan and her fellow Spaniards have already qualified for the Olympic Games in Paris. The dream of every American child is to suit up for the red, white, and blue. But if Team USA never comes calling, hey, the red, yellow, and red is waiting. Playing for Team USA, that would have been really cool. Um, obviously, being from America, but honestly, being in the Olympics, regardless of who I'm playing for, um, it really doesn't matter to me. I'm I'm just super excited to make it more about you know what's on the front of my jersey, not on the back. I get so emotional about it because Megan is. Um, one of the all-time greatest people I know. And from a class of 11, you know, now competing in the Euro Cup and going to play in the Olympics, that is big time. Team USA, they never reached out. Um, I've never played for them, but, I mean, I'm just going to go somewhere else and play for them. So I'm, I'm really excited. <laughs>